Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Trish Nystrom. I'm a local real estate agent here in beautiful Gainesville, Florida, and I work with Watson Realty. If you've been on my channel before, you know my usual sidekick bubbles. Well, she had something else to do today, so I brought in the string bee. There's little dog and ladybug. Today we are visiting the historic area down in Gainesville called Duck Pond, the Duck Pond neighborhood. So sit tight, relax, and I'll meet you down by the duck pond. If you're like me and you love old houses, the duck pond neighborhood could be for you. Duck Pond is also called the Northeast Historic District, and it's located north of University Avenue to 13th Avenue and east of Main Street to 9th Street. This neighborhood is really walkable from downtown and to all the downtown restaurants and the entertainment. Duck Pond is a really eclectic mix of home styles and renovations. The neighborhood began in the 1870s and now covers 292 acres and it's broken down into eight smaller subdivisions. 290 homes are now designated as historic homes and can be identified by the blue plaque next to the front door. The neighborhood got its name when, in 1926, a retention basin was built in the middle of the Sweetwater Branch Creek, which flows through the area. Ducks enjoyed coming to the basin and, of course, staying, and the area then became known as Duck Pond. Duck Pond people residents are really social and they love their neighborhood. They enjoy the tree-lined streets and the sidewalk and, of course, relaxing next to the Duck Pond. Duck Pond was considered quite the elite area and very exclusive back in the day. And between 1909 and 1950, four University of Florida presidents had homes in the Duck Pond neighborhood. And the singer, the late Tom Petty, also grew up in the area. In the heart of the area, you'll find the Thomas Center. It is a historic building, and this began as a private home of the Thomas family. It became a hotel, and it's now used to home some governmental offices and used as uh, art for art exhibitions and cultural events. You can tour the building and the well-manicured gardens. There are 24 homes built before 1900, mostly Queen Anne style with the jutting gables and the large verandas. It's said that business owners and merchants would walk home at lunchtime to eat with the family before heading back to work. If you're into older homes or renovations of, of older homes, this is absolutely the area for you. Hey everybody, I hope you enjoyed the tour of Duck Pond. If you'd like to know what's available for sale in the Duck Pond or any other area here in the Gainesville area, my contact information is down below in the description area. If you're on a mobile device and you don't see the description area, tap on the name of this video and the description area will open up. You'll see my contact information and you'll also see a link to my free, and I did say free, buyer's guide. So tap on the link for the buyer's guide and I'll send that to you free of charge. Also, while you're clicking on stuff, give me a thumbs up and don't forget to hit the subscribe and hit that little bell icon. You'll be notified every time a new video is put out. And hey, you never know what's coming up. <laughs> I'll see you next week. Until then, stay safe. Bye-bye.